Do you know why he called himself the artist when he came back? He calls himself the artist because that's what they call us in our contracts. Oh, these contracts are crazy. You should hear the terminology they say in these contracts. To use your name and likeness and perpetuity throughout the universe. Who the f could possibly know what that means? <laughs> Nobody does. It's so complicated, in fact, that when you're a kid like me, you have to hire somebody to tell you what that means. And you sit down at a table and you do the contract game. And that's how I got with Comedy Central. The way that a 28 year old expecting father that was broke signs a contract. I was desperate, okay. I needed a way out, and it wasn't good money, and it wasn't good circumstances, but uh, what else am I gonna do, I said. And all these white people sitting at that table told me, trust us, Dave, it's a good contract. And I looked around the table and they all seemed to agree it was a good contract. But what if, what if it was like that game of three card Monty? What if they were all friends and I didn't know it? People think I made a lot of money for Chappelle's show. When I left that show, I never got paid. They didn't have to pay me because I signed the contract. But is that right? They just took it. And I'm not up here trying to tell you guys okay. that I believe that Comedy Central gave me a raw deal just because I'm black. I believe that they gave me a raw deal because this fucking industry is a monster. It's the same monster that these Me Too bitches was trying to tell you about. But they hate the monster for how it fucks. And I hate that monster for how it eats. But my God, man, it's the same monster. When I quit the show, all my friends would say, well, if them, Dave, why don't you just do Chappelle's show at another network? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And why doesn't a slave run from one plantation to another plantation? Because the master over there might be nicer. Good. My God, man, I was trapped. You know what? Tell you the truth. Tell you the truth. I've even thought about coming back and doing another Chappelle show. Well... But if I do, I can't call it Chappelle Show because my name and likeness is being used by them in perpetuity throughout the universe. It's in the contract. I'm telling you something that you need to know. I'm trying to explain to you what you're seeing. You don't understand what you're seeing. I am publicly flogging a network. And I know that this network is the they watching me and they saying, why, why, why are you doing this so, so publicly? Doesn't feel good to be flogged publicly. Oh, believe me, I know. I know exactly how that feels. When I quit my show, they said I was crazy. What was crazy about it? I just didn't want to do it anymore. They said I smoked crack. That's impossible. I was a devout Muslim. I didn't smoke or drink. But I do now, bitch, because you ruined my life. Yeah. Now it's their turn. This is their first lesson, and I'm honored to give it to them. 